I just wanted to do a quick video to uh, showcase this Color Science SPF powder that I'm very excited about. I suck at reapplying sunscreen every two hours, at least to my face, as is recommended. You know, when it comes to sunscreen on the body, that's easy for me to, you know, just keep respraying because when you have your makeup on for the day, you're like, oh, do I really want to put more lotion on top of makeup and have all these layers? And, or, you know, am I gonna wash my face out and about while I'm at work and then re put everything on for the sake of reapplying? So I'm excited that I. I stumbled upon this product. So I'll show you how it goes on um, in a little bit, but just to give you a little bit of information about the product, it is a, um, an SPF of 50, and it's a mineral sunscreen rather than chemical, and they say it protects against both UVA and UVB. Um, one of the other things I like about it is that it's non-comonogenic, so it's not gonna clog my pores. I do have oily skin, so looking out for those type of products is important to me. And it comes in four shades. I got shade medium, which uh, looks kind of light. The next one up would have been tan, and that looked more closely to my color, but I intend on just using this like as a touch up on the go you know I have my regular um, sunscreen that I put on as my final step in my daytime routine before makeup's July right now it's been hot this weekend I've been using it all weekend and I love it so far not sure how it would work out if you intended on using this like as your own foundation or like a cover-up it doesn't really appear that it's you know has more of like a foundation base to use I mean unless you don't need a lot of makeup yeah, I just it kind of has like a finishing powder type use to it. And so if you find this video useful so far, please hit the thumbs up button considering subscribing. Um, but yeah, um, but what I'm going to show you right now is the actual application. So it's got this um, cap that goes that's on it. So you tap it with the cap on your palm a few times, open it and it's got this little sleeve and you just kind of give it a flick. And then you can go into your application and that's why I didn't want to get a darker color because I feel like if I would have got like a tan it would just like you know stick on my my oil that I have um, you know even if I were to blot my face first I feel like it would look patchy so I like it and it hasn't given me you know any like spots uh, from uneven application or anything it's just been pretty easy to use as a touch-up and you put the cap back up or the sleeve cap and you're done. as far as the size um the box was smaller than i uh suspected it looked long in a lot of the pictures on the website and everything um so it says that it's 0.6 grams or 0.21 ounces um, i can see already um you can see that it's kind of you can see the top level because i wasn't sure if the powder was like in this whole part or you know just a little bit right there so um i guess we'll see how long it lasts this point it was a little bit expensive i think with tax and shipping and everything uh, it was maybe 70 dollars or 75 dollars so these ads started popping up and i uh just went for it because i know the urgency of re reapplication and it's summertime so i wanted to try something as soon as possible i don't know if there's a lot of other products out there similar but i probably will look around Maybe there's something not as pricey out there, but so far so good, I like it. I ordered directly from their website for my first time trying this product. You'll see here they have the four color options there with these dots. Um, they also have two purchase options and I did the $69 one-time purchase, but depending on how long this product lasts me and what the frequency is on the subscribe and save, I might check that out. And then you'll see they also have some other bundle options here. One thing to consider um, if you're planning on maybe getting this for a trip or anything like that, it did take me a little bit to receive the order. I don't know if it was just my order or um, all of their shipments take that long, but I ordered it on June 25th. And then on June 28th, I got an email that they had a delay at their warehouse um, that would delay the shipping. And then I ultimately received it on July 6th, so like 11 days later. And, you know, I, I was waiting for it. But like I said, if you have a trip or something that you're anticipating, you might want to keep that in mind. Other than that, for the expensiveness of the products, it came with this cute little... Um, instructional seat, sheet that has like maybe 17 or 18 different languages that I are counted already which is cute so uh, you get this nice little souvenir with your 70 75 dollar order um, I hope you found this video useful if so please hit like please hit subscribe and share below in the comments what your tips are for the all-important reapplication every two hours thanks for watching and stopping by have a great day